Hello everyone. This is going to be a review on the 24 piece shanty brush set that I purchased from Amazon.com. Now, I purchased these brushes because um, I needed another set of, well I didn't need another set, I wanted another set of brushes and I, there were only a few reviews on YouTube and I did read the reviews that were on Amazon.com. The reviews were fair. Um, they didn't say they were great. Um, they just, the reviews I would say were between, you know, somewhere in the middle. So I thought to myself, surely they can't be, you know, worse than elf brushes. Elf brushes are only a dollar. Well, y'all just stay tuned to see my overall rating on the shanty brushes. Okay, so let's start off. The first thing to me, based off my little knowledge that I have received on makeup brushes is, you want to find out if the brushes shed a lot. Okay? So, Shani, the this is the face brush. And I don't know if you can see, but there's little hair sticking up on these on this brush here. I can just pull out several hairs of this. This brush has been washed, it's been conditioned, it's been oiled. Everything you need to do or supposed to do with a brush is been done to, okay? And as you can see, it shed a whole, whole lot, okay? Now that's after washing the brush. Also, um, one of the fan brushes, let me find it. When I took this out of the package, this fan brush, you see how it looks kind of a little lopsided a little bit? When I took it out the package and did like this to it, I promise half the hairs was in my hand, literally. Half the, ha the hairs was in my hand. And if you can see, I don't know if I can angle it, if you can see all the little hairs sticking from this brush, I'm just picking them as they're sticking up. Okay, so there's lots of shedding in this brush, in this brush set. So the next thing I want to talk about is the texture the texture of the brushes. So what I'm comparing these brushes to is my ELF set, my Echo 2 set, and my Revlon set. Okay, so here is the Shani face brush here. This is the ELF face brush, and this is the Echo 2 face brush. Now, between the three, to touch, the Echo Tools is the softest. This is the softest. That's one of the key characteristics that you're going to look in a brush set. It is the bristles soft. Is, are they soft to the touch? To your face? Very, very soft. This Echo Tools. Very soft. Elf will come in second place. As you can see, the bristles, I'm not sure if you can see it, but the bristles look kind of sparse a little bit. Um, this would be number two. Two in softness, okay? And then this uh, shanty would come in third at, compared to texture and softness, okay? The third thing I'm looking at when I'm looking at brushes is... Um, how they pick up product. So I'm going to give you a little example of what I'm talking about. And I didn't really realize this until I started using a different kind of brush. So this is my, and this is my favorite eyeshadow brush here. Um, man, I don't like my Echo Tools. I don't like my Revlon. This is the Bomb Eyeshadow Brush. This is the Elf Eyeshadow Brush. This is like my absolute favorite eyeshadow brush. So I'm going to try to give you a comparison to how this picks up product versus the Shani picks up product. Or I can even do my Echo Tools because my Echo Tools to me don't pick up product like this brush. So can you see that? This is Riotous, uh, the Hip Duo. And I'm going to put a little product on that. I hope you guys can see it. 
Now, can you see how concentrated the product is on that brush? Yes. Okay. Picks up product very well. This Echo Two, this um, Elf brush. Okay. Now I'm going to get a shiny eyeshadow brush, and we'll see. Here's the Hilt Duo. Okay. Now, now, can you tell? Let me let me put this uh, shiny up. Now, it does have product on it, okay? Can you tell the difference? This did not pick up that much product on it. And this I, this uh, e.l.f. has a lot of product on it. So, when I say the shanty did not pick up product well, I also use this to put in my facial, uh, my powder. And when I did, like, you know, whatever I was doing, I didn't hardly see no product. I had to constantly keep dipping it in the product. So to me, that's the third thing you want to look at, is how well are the bristles of the brush picking up product, okay? So based on, you know, what I told you, um, basically, I, I'm rating all the facial brushes from Shani, the, uh, like, the lip liner and the other little small brushes, I didn't even fool with them. These are all the facial, the big, brushes and the eyeshadow brushes but based off you know what I told you on, on a scale of one to five I would rate these brushes a two now I must say I did get a nice black leather roll out of the deal that I will probably use for a nicer brush set but the next set of brushes that I will probably invest in is going to be the e.l.f. Studio line. I mean, they're like $3 a brush, but they're supposed to be like an upgrade than the dollar brushes. And also, if you're a beginner, um, I would suggest you go to Dollar General and get you the dollar um, e.l.f. brushes, eyeshadow brushes. This is where I got this one from. This was a dollar. And this is like the bomb, y'all. When I say this is the bomb, I'm telling you, it's the bomb. <laughs> so anyway, that's just a little review of my thoughts on the Shani brushes. Um, I know everybody have different, you know, thoughts and opinions about different products, but that's based on my use of the brushes. And no, I would not recommend this brush set to you. You can go and get a nicer, inexpensive set, better quality with no shedding. Um, my e.l.f. brushes, I never had any problems with the shedding on my e.l.f. brushes. Neither my Echo Tools. Very inexpensive set of brushes. Okay, I think that is going to be it on the brush review. You guys have a good evening. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah, let me add this in. This little cute, colorful green and brown and white jacket is another one of my thrift store finds. I totally, I was putting it on this morning, and I was like, oh yeah, I did get this from a thrift store. But yes, this cute, hope you guys can see it, jacket, this was a thrift store find maybe um, a year ago, maybe, yeah, maybe last summer. I love it. I love the colors. So, that's it, y'all. I'm gone. Bye-bye.